You're watching WMAR 2 News. I'm Randall Newsom here with your WMAR 2 News update. Anne Arundel County has lost nearly 200 teachers since the beginning of the school year. One way they plan to fix that is to ask for a pay raise. A union leader says they're asking for an 8% increase to account for the cost of living. In order to make this happen, uh, there will likely be an increase in property taxes. The county's budget proposal calls for an increase of $0.05 cents per $100, resulting in about $68 million in annual recurring revenue. I can understand that people don't like their ta taxes raised, but I also know that this county is one of the lowest paid counties for teachers and, you know, the time is now. And the final vote on this budget is set for mid-June. Well, Baltimore City Public Schools is hosting a college and career readiness expo today. Reps from more than 60 colleges, universities, and businesses will be there. They'll also have panel discussions and many workshops. Students of all ages are welcome, but the focus of this expo is for middle and high school students. It runs from 4 to 8 today at Coppin State University's physical, edu physical education complex. And now for a check on our forecast with meteorologist Cesar Cornejo. Well, Randall, we can expect to see that this afternoon is going to look fantastic out there as we continue to see plenty of sunshine and temperatures hanging around the low 80s. While there will be a noticeable tint, and that's going to be thanks to the wildfire smoke still making its way in from the Canadian wildfires, we are going to still feel, feel very summer-like out there. Looking at temperatures throughout the entire state, we'll all hang around those upper 70s and even low 80s for us, Randall. All right, 80s sound good to me, man. All right, guys, stay with WMAR2news.com for updates on stories throughout the day. And for news and weather while you're on the go, download the WMAR2news app in your app store. Thanks for watching. I'm Randall Newsom.